How Alcohol Affects the Body Alcohol consumption can have irreversible consequences for the body. Find out how our body responds to this substance and what the main effects may be. Alcohol consumption is a widely socialized and established habit. However, it is a toxic substance for the body and, while its consumption at low doses and sporadically has rapidly reversible effects, its consumption both at high doses and prolonged has undesirable consequences on the body. Alcohol causes short-term, acute alcohol effects, manifesting as alcohol intoxication that can lead in extreme cases to coma and death. The first phase is acute alcoholic intoxication, also called drunkenness, causing acute effects on the central nervous system, euphoria, excitement, disinhibition and impulsive behavior. When drinking continues, a higher level of intoxication occurs, intoxication, impaired balance, impaired coordination, and loss of heat. In more advanced phases, there is an alteration in the level of consciousness, confusion, sleep, lethargy, vomiting, anesthetic and stupor. Acute alcohol intake can also cause gastric problems such as acute gastritis, heart rhythm disturbances, arrhythmias, especially if mixed with other substances, drugs, serious socio-family problems. It favors risk behaviors such as traffic accidents or risky sexual practices, sexually transmitted diseases, and unwanted pregnancies. In the long term and with chronic alcohol intake, more irreversible damage to the body appears. In addition, the risk of suffering these damages is greater the earlier the consumption begins, which is usually in adolescence. Effects on the central nervous system. Alcohol is especially toxic to neurons, causing permanent neural damage and loss. Also on peripheral nerves. It is related to the development of dementia, memory loss and cognitive impairment, diseases such as Wernicke-Korsakoff syndrome and sleep and character disorders. In addition to disorders associated with the degree of alcohol dependence, withdrawal syndrome, alcoholic encephalopathy, etc. Effects on the gastrointestinal system. In the digestive system, it can affect any tract of the same, both its acute and chronic consumption, favoring the appearance of esophageal diseases, esophagitis, reflux disease, gastric, gastritis, gastric bleeding, liver, liver cirrhosis, and pancreas, acute and chronic pancreatitis. High consumption has been linked to cancer of the stomach, larynx, esophagus, and pancreas. In addition, its continued consumption causes malnutrition problems, since it provides a large number of calories with very little nutritional value, empty calories, prevents the absorption of some minerals and vitamins and suppresses appetite. Cardiovascular Effects Alcohol consumption causes an increase in cardiac activity. It can increase blood pressure causing high blood pressure. It also produces heart damage whose most typical manifestation is dilated cardiomyopathy, an injury to the heart muscle that weakens and causes very serious heart failure. Blood effects. It prevents the production of white and red blood cells, causing a type of anemia called megaloblastic anemia and a failure in the immune system due to the decrease in white blood cells, making alcoholics more susceptible to infections. Effects of alcohol on pregnancy and the fetus. Alcohol consumption during pregnancy can cause the so-called fetal alcohol syndrome in the fetus, it is the term used to group a large number of anomalies that a baby can present when exposed to alcohol during pregnancy. These include morphological malformations, especially craniofacial defects, growth retardation, and cognitive, behavioral, socialization, and learning disorders. It also decreases sexual desire and can cause infertility and erectile dysfunction. What you should know. Acute alcohol intoxication or drunkenness causes acute effects on the central nervous system. It manifests itself initially or mildly as euphoria, arousal, disinhibition, and impulsive behaviors. If you continue drinking, you pass to the phase of intoxication, with impaired balance, coordination, and loss of heat. More advanced phases alter the level of consciousness with confusion, sleep, lethargy, vomiting, and finally anesthetic phase and stupor.